At long last, our heroes find themselves faced with another city gym. How will Milo fare against the fiery will of his opponents? Hello, Milo. Hi. An amount of time passes since uh -huh. Phoebe has entered the cold stone door of uh -huh. the Xantha gym. You can hear the like scraping of hard stone from inside the building and the, the ground around you is kind of quaking a little bit oh, as the boy. door once more just opens up and Phoebe steps out and just goes, hi. <laughs> I would ask you questions, but I know you can't answer them. Yeah, Yigru just goes, please, no speaking. <laughs> no speaking of the insights. Who is next? Uh, that's me. Okay. Good luck to you. Uh, thank you, I'm gonna need it. Do you want water before you go? Uh, yes, please. You want some cookies too? No, okay. if, if I can make it out. Oh, okay, a reward cookie, okay. Perfect. Excellent. Okay, so as you enter the Xantha City Gym, oh, God. the cold, massive stone door opens up into darkness. Uh -huh. and as you step in, it's it slowly creaks shut behind you as you look out and see your friends as they kind of wave at you. It just closes, leaves you in complete darkness. You're standing on what appears to be like really smooth stone. It's almost like really glossy tile, but it's pitch black. As four plumes of magma begin to pour down from the walls, oh, illuminating cool. your surroundings. Okay. Um, you can see you're standing on what's like volcanic glass. You can see your reflection in the wall um, all the way down, kind of like flickering in the firelight. And you can see um, a silhouette of a person, probably 40 or so feet ahead of you in this, in this chamber. Oh boy. And you... Uh, you can see, like, in the firelight, it's it's clearly, like, a young lady in a, in a red jumpsuit. She's got long hair, and it's pulled back. She's got safety goggles on. She kind of lifts them off. She just goes, I'm Mackenzie. This is challenge number one. Oh, boy. You ready? I guess so. Okay. This will be a triple battle. <laughs> okay. All right, send out my team. Um, oh, I need another. I've got Violet, Howl, and Little Buddy. Oh, and, uh, <laughs> Dear God. So I'm like, all right, Little Buddy, Howl, this is, uh, this is kind of going to be in your element. Um, Literally. Yep. So, uh, um, um, I know you guys will do well. Um, Violet, this is going to be probably the toughest challenge <laughs> of, of the journey so far, but I have nothing but faith in you. Okay. With that, go ahead and roll three initiatives. Oh, you may. Okay, so. I am pooping my pants. Top of the combat. As the Growlithe, Vulpix, and Magby hit the field in no particular order, um, Growlithe just closes the gap. This sure. Is Growlithe is yeah. amber. Growlithe is the amber one. Growlithe goes... Runs up and attempts to bite whoever you have placed in the middle. That's Howl. Howl. Okay, it's going after Howl. Um, interesting to note, Howl has flash fire. Incoming fire damage. With a bite attack? Fire fang from oh. Growlithe. Um, 15 to hit you. That'll hit. Do, 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 do. That is three points of fire damage okay. to Howl. Um, but it says I'm resistant. So you're going factor that? So you take one. Okay. Yeah, so Howl takes uh, almost no damage yeah. as this Growlithe like, sinks his teeth in there. Howl kind of like, if, if, if a dog could laugh, <laughs> it's, it's like, okay. it's like the tickles. Um, and then it's Howl's turn. Dang, okay. He will, <laughs> he will retaliate with a bite of his own. Yeah, bite that fool. Make it happen. For an eight to hit. Eight does not hit. God. Eight will miss. Um, as Howl goes in for a, a bite against the Growlithe, it's just yeah. you can't quite whip around fast enough before the Growlithe is out of out of effective range. Okay. The Vulpix will stare straight ahead at whichever of your combatants you've placed there. Violet. And Violet, I need Violet to make a dexterity saving throw. Okay. Six. All right. Come on. 
So, uh, Violet takes two points of fire damage. Okay. And is burned. Oh, God. So her next attack deals half damage. Okay. Okay. And then after that is Little Buddy. Little Buddy is going to close the gap over here and tackle Growlithe. Oh, snap. With advantage, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. my hope with how mm-hmm. terribly I'm starting. Yeah, tackle him in the face. That's a nine. Yikes. Okay. Ooh, uh, ten. Nine and a ten, huh? Come on! Yeah, little buddy goes in for a tackle on the ground with him, just, like, hits him, but he's so small, <laughs> I just... Come on. He just collides Team. for nothing. Um, after little buddy is the Magby. Come Who on. goes... Yeah, what the heck, man? Come back. And attempts to punch Little Buddy. Also with advantage with yeah. Little Buddy's blanket. Yeah. That's bad. That's worse. Um, does an 11 hit Little Buddy? No. He misses. Oh, my God. The punch comes down next to Little Buddy, who just goes, yes. he's kind of tackling into the, into the hound door. And just, or not the hound door. The rally. Yeah. There's too many small <laughs> quadrupedals, <laughs> firebox. Yeah, so he uh, he misses. The, his punch hits the Good. the cold stone floor. Good. Um, Violet. Okay. So it's worth noting your your burn will go away if you do like combat punch and you hit once, okay. and then the next one will do full. So the first punch. Your does first half your first punch deals half. Okay. I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna. I'm, gonna, I'm going, going for over the, the advantage I'm on going, the I'm going for the take one out at a time okay. deal here. I like it. I like it. Okay. So go Comet Punch is dealing five, five hits. hits oh, hopefully. Okay, here you go. And They're I all in a miss. So I couldn't do focus energy. Okay. So you have three hits, a crit, and a miss. Okay. Um, so your first one is at half damage. Okay. So roll a d4 and okay. divide by two. And we'll, we'll. One. So one. Okay. okay. So he goes to that. So and then next one. It's three and then the crit? Three and then the crit. Okay. Boop. Four. Two. And then double this one. And then double this one. Come on, baby. Six. Six. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Big. Okay. So as um, as Violet kind of flies over to this Growlithe, seeing her whole all of her friends surrounding it, just goes goes in for some solid punches. Love it. Um, clocks Growlithe like a bunch of times, and then once it turns around, it goes what? And just cracks it, and you can see a little fang kind of gets like knocked oh, a, little, a little aside. Um, the Growlithe is very unhappy uh, <laughs> with Violet after that whole maneuver. Um, and it's it's gonna attempt to bite her no. on the face. No. Um, it is not flanking Violet, um, but that is an 18 to hit plus an amount. Yeah. So that is yes, that is enough. So here comes here comes some damage to you. That is nine points of fire damage. Ow! As the Growlithe rolls a max damage fire fang. Ow! That's that a big hit. Super not good. Big hit super, to super Violet. Super not good. Very big hit to Violet. Okay. Um, and then it is uh, Howl's turn as Growlithe is currently like biting into Violet's. Gooey center. Okay, he's gonna go for a bite again. Now that he's the support yeah. of his friends. So you have advantage plus two. Okay. You are flanking, and he's just surrounded. Okay. On a, he's beset on all sides. So add two to whatever rolls the mm-hmm. highest. Yes. Okay. Add two to whatever's the highest plus whatever you get. Unnatural so like basically, crit. eat him, eat him alive. Crit. Um. Yeah. So <gasps> go ahead and roll your damage. Okay. So it is. This, no, this one, and a d4. That and a d4. Um, and then double both. Oh. So eight, eight points of damage. Um, he goes down. Oh, he's thank down. God. How does, yes. how does Howl take out this Growlithe that's like eating his friend? Um, yeah, ex- exactly that. Seeing this Growlithe that's attacking Violet, mm-hmm. um, uh, Howl sees, did I call it a growl? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> See, Seeing this, this growl. Yeah, this growl that's that's uh, biting its friend um, and severely weakening it. Mm-hmm. It just sees its, like, opening and just goes for a nice hearty bite in its side, like, pushing it out of the way. Sees it goes down and, like, kind of puts out a paw and high fives its friends. Cool, cool. Um, does, does Howl want to move? Uh... 
Like, you still have phone numbers? Yes. Like, you can go I, and kind of like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to, like, drop hints without dropping hints. Well, I, I was going to do it yeah. anyway, yeah. just because, like, he's going to try to protect the other two, because he feels paternal on this particular... Papa thing. Howell. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, Volpix. Woof. Um, Volpix is going to look at all three of you. Okay. Um, and it's going to choose, let's see, this one. Okay. Um, LB. Yes. Please make a dexterity save. All right, LB. Little buddy. Little buddy. Nine. Nine. Mm. Interesting. So, you take four points of fire damage. So two, oh no, four. Little Pix is done. Is little buddy. Little buddy, um, I forgot to give, I need to remember after this battle to give someone the charcoal. He'll just go for, for the ember. Okay, Screw let's it. go for the ember. Boom. Good thing he's flanked. <laughs> uh-huh. Bye. Nope, just kidding. No. Ten. Did you do? Ten is because I don't add enough. anymore. Just the advantage, right? Correct. Okay. Uh, on the bright side, your burn wears off at the end of your turn. Okay. So it just kind of That's a little buddy just looks a little happy. <laughs> he kind of like messes with his hair for a second, and he feels a little better. Um, on the Magby's turn, um, he sees that little buddy's kind of spitting flames toward him. He's he didn't like that one bit. He's gonna try to punch him. That is a 12. Ah, oh, yep. Okay, incoming some damage. Six fire damage. Six fire? Did I do that oh, one? No. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, so he, yeah, he goes in and just whack, punches, okay. punches his little buddy in, in his cute little face. Okay. He feels a little bad about it, but. Whatever. He's yeah. gonna move on. Um, Violet. All right, Violet's gonna come up on full picks here. Oh yeah, and just yeah. start punching? Yeah. Laying down the hurt. I don't, I'm afraid if if flame body's a thing, I don't know if it would affect like every punch, so I don't want to risk that. Ow. So I'm not gonna. Ow. I'm just gonna go Ow. for the comet punch on Volpix. Perfect. For three, four, four, four punches. punches. You remember, crit on 19 or 20. Yep. Again. Two hits come in. For three, three, four. <laughs> you just throw it. I through. couldn't pick it up. It flew, whatever. Violet flies over to Volpix and just. Goes for the four punches and hits so hard with like two at the same time and kind of like spins and then spins backwards that it's really like only as if two punches hit. Towel, yeah, top of the round. All right, he's round. gonna go for a bite mm-hmm. on the Magby. Get him, get him, dude. It's an unnatural twenty, but you never know. No, oh, yikes. Yeah, that twenty looking pretty good now. D four, D eight. Come on, D4, dude. D four, D eight. Four. Uh, that's on Megby? Yeah. Okay. Uh, D8. <laughs> my D4 is out producing uh, uh, by a ton. You take one point of hot body damage. Is, is that's that not what it's called? Is that already halved? Yeah. Um, so Howl is done. It's Volpix. Volpix is going to look at Violet and request another dexterity save. Okay. Come on, Violet. You got this. Violet, I believe in you. Dicks. It's eight. It's All right. Enough. That's a yeah, three uh, three damage, and she's oh, burned. Oh no! So, <laughs> oh no! The next, next punch is is no good. Yep. Um, little buddy, little buddy, little buddy's yeah. gonna amber again. You going after Megby? Yeah. Nice. Make it happen. Get it. Get it, LB. For a fifteen to hit or yeah. A f- fifteen. To hit. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay, so I get to roll two of these because yes. flash fire. Yes, you do. So bada boom, come on. Is it a one? Yeah. No. Uh, <laughs> four damage four. total. Oh no. Come on. <laughs> Migby is half dead. <sighs> he's, he's a half dead guy. Okay. Um, but it is his turn. And he's going to attempt to punch Little Buddy no. in his cute little nose for a nine. That does that is, not hit. That is insufficient. Um, beautiful, beautiful. Moving on to Violet. Okay, she's got a. Violet. She's gonna focus energy. Okay, because she doesn't yeah, have to move. And then she's gonna combo punch. You got this, Violet. You got this. For five attacks, love Make it. Make it happen. Love a lot. Okay. So three miss. Two <laughs> three miss, and one's a natural one. And two this eight. one is the one that sucks. So one so damage. So one damage. Big money. Yes. So five. Five total. Boom. 
Way to go. Proud of you. Proud of you, champ. Proud of you, As Violet. Violet just goes... Punches a couple times. One of them is just exceptionally bad. It's yeah. like an open hand like slap in the face. <laughs> it's just real, real not good. Um, For sure. And then Howl sees Violet just pounding on uh, the Vulpix and a mag be in front of him. And it's super flanked. What does he do? Oh, it's Howl's turn? Yeah, what's oh, he gonna boy. do? About it? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What are you gonna do about it, Howl? Um, huh? Huh? Dig it, dig it, dig it. I gotta, I gotta stay here and take my advantage here. Howl's just gonna try to finish the job. Cool. For an unnatural 20 Ooh. or a natural 20. Howl, oh pick. my god, Howl. Killing it. Come on, not, not another one Come on. on the D8. Hit him, hit him hard. Oh! <laughs> so that's six. This is like six. Yeah. Gotcha. So close. Ah. So stinking close. And then you take half of this die's 0.5. Take yeah. one fire damage. Ow, this is why I brought uh, you. What? Yeah. Uh, Volt picks his turn. Volt picks looks at Violet and goes, hey, make a deck save. Here we go. For a 15. Nothing happens. Yeah! As the, like, the black spiral of fire goes up towards Violet and just mixes in with the aura and she just goes... <sighs> And just powers it away. Oh, Violet. Um, little buddy. You got this, little buddy. You can do it. My little buddy, Ember him. Ember him. Ember him. Little buddy. You get advantage. Finish just it. Kill him. Finish it. Okay. Not with that, yes. though. Come on, dude. No. <laughs> Two to three. Six. Oh, no. That is not enough. That is yeah. exactly half Come of what you on. needed. Come on. Uh, so yeah, little buddy's ember just goes this is a just goes wide as uh, Magby nice. attempts to just finish the job no. and punch him in the face. That's that's a lot. That is over a twenty. Yeah. Um, incoming is some damage. Oh no. Um, it is six points no. of the damage. Oh, little buddy, little buddy goes down. Little buddy goes down. Little buddy's fainted. All right, it's two on two. No. It's, you guys are going uh, punch for punch here. <laughs> it's getting it's getting oh, a little gosh. icy. Um, so that's that's Magby's turn. Is he just clocks little buddy and little buddy just gets stars in his eyes and goes no. down? Um, Violet. All right, Violet. Violet, finish the job. Ultimate punch for another five comet punches. All right, with her focus energy. Yeah, I get it. Okay, so your first one's a crit, and then three hits. So, so you six, like six, and then mm -hmm. three more hits. Six and three more hits. You, you One, two, so that's three, four, so ten total damage. You guys love leaving things with one hit point. I'm you? pretty, I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah, that's a that's a solid that was series good. of consecutive normal punches. Oh. As Violet comes in, gives him the old one, two, three, four. Um, he's yeah, Volpix is very displeased with you, but it is hell's go. I'm gonna take an attack of opportunity. And okay. over to Volpix. Okay. He misses. Yes! And Magby just punches wide. How so fast. Yeah. Boom. So you have advantage. Yep. That's the point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 11, 11 both times. 11 that total. Sucks. That misses. I know. <laughs> yeah. That's not, that's not enough. Uh, After Hal is the Volpix, who just looks at Violet and goes, hey, make another deck seat. Please, Violet. Please, Violet. Just succeed. Please, yes. Violet. No, 10. 10? Yeah, you're gonna take some damage. That's four. She has got four fire. Violet goes down. Violet goes down. You can do it. You can do it. It is Magby's turn. Magby's gonna waddle his, his little butt. Of course he is. This is not looking so good. All over, he's gonna attempt to punch Hal with advantage. Uh -huh. um, he punches you Okay. In, in the face for some damage. Uh, that is four. Is this a fire punch? It is a fire punch. Okay, and that's already halved. So you take two. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Okay, now I'm up. It's beautiful. It is now Hell's turn. Okay, bite Vulpix. Finish him off. Finish him off. Finish him off for a 14 to hit. That exactly hits. Thank God. That's what you need. And magic. Seven. Done. Vulpix goes down. Beautiful. How does Hell take out a Vulpix? 
uh, creatures he's never seen before. He's just adrenaline high right now um, as he just kind of grabs it, like bites it in the side, and just tosses it and then just turns to Magby. Oh, sick. I like it. Okay, um, on Magby's turn, he's he's a little intimidated. Just a little bit. He tries to punch you. It's a 14. That is. Okay, here comes a punch. In the face. Uh, half a seven is three. If you look at it that way. Okay. So you take three points of damage from the Magby Punch. Alright. It's strong, but like mortars way, way tougher. But so I'm, I'm just gonna bite him then. Yeah. Yeah, just kill him. Bite him in the face. Who cares? 20 unnatural. Yeah. You're throwing those all day. Keep it up. Yeah, Yeah, bite him. Bite him hard. It's that or twos. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Eight damage. Eight. That's pretty uh, sad. How does Howl take out another Just opponent? Does he kill Magby? Um, interestingly, he's... Uh, not gonna bite because he doesn't want to take the damage, but he's just gonna headbutt him with his like skull on skull, top okay. and knock him to the bottom and just like just right in the gut and launch him. I like it. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. As Mackenzie scoops up her team, just goes, "Hey, good job." To you too. That was insane. It's like, yeah, I'm I'm still kind of new here. They don't really respect me, but that was a close fight. Thanks <laughs> for thanks for letting me feel like I had a chance. <laughs> she goes, uh. Oh, I owe you. I owe you something. And she pulls out a small envelope with not a lot of money in there, unfortunately. Six dollars. Okay. You get six bucks. Sweet. Um, and money. yeah, and then she like she basically like scoops up her team and just like walks towards the the front and kind of lays them out and starts spraying potions on them. It's like, okay. Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta be ready in case someone else comes through the door. Um, but yeah, so moving forward. Past the the room with like the the volcano walls, um, you see like an actual replica volcano in the room in front of you. Oh, cool! Um, it goes up like forty feet, Dang. and it's like a big uh, rocky surface. Uh-huh. Um, and the, there's a sign that just says "Next Challenge." Up. <laughs> um, and as you enter the room, if you would put your Pokemon away, they're all sent out, and you hear a as your Pokeballs power down. Huh. Okay. So your next challenge is to climb the volcano with your whole team. Okay. Leaving no one behind. Okay. How steep is it? It's like almost vertical, but it's it's kind of like this. So like okay. you could kind of scrabble up there, but there there'd be some checks involved. Okay. So I think he's small enough that I'm gonna give little buddy to Violet, so yeah. that she can just fly. Sure. And and uh, not I don't want her to go up ahead because I don't know what's up there, mm-hmm. but just like it's pretty easy to. Yeah. She basically like buzzes along, and little buddy's just like. Yeah. Happily and smiling away as he gets lifted up. Uh, Howl and I, we're gonna do, we're gonna do it together. Okay. And I'm gonna have him let out a howl to psych us up. Yeah. And then cool. we're gonna like, go until we start to slow down and just like, grab on and stay okay. where we're at. Grab where we are. And okay. then like, it, like a, like a row team. And then he'll just howl and we'll look at each other and like, get yeah. any, as much more as we can. I like it. So roll a d20. Okay. See how far you get on your first run. An eight. Eight. Okay. So you and Howl make it like eight feet up, mm-hmm. and then you kind of yeah, kind of grab onto the side of the wall. Yeah. And then he lets out another Howl. Okay. Go ahead and try again. Three. All right. You make it a little further. It's, it's starting to get pretty steep. Yeah. Um. So now we're gonna we're gonna say, from here on out, you and Howl are gonna are like he's got his claws kind of stuck into the the rocks. And you're kind of climbing up alongside him, so it'll be some strength checks for me. Okay. Let's keep um, going. He can still howl and like say yeah, but yeah. I want to. Are we like right next to each other? Yeah. yeah. I want to like He's kind like, of sidle over a little bit mm-hmm. and like let him get on my back and jump. Okay. Let him get a little further. Yeah. Teamwork. I like it. Okay. So have. Let's see. What is Howl's uh, strength score? Thirteen. So, how can jump from your back an extra four feet? Just okay. Now. Okay. And then he'll kind of look back and wait for you to catch up. Okay. And then I'll make my strength check. Yeah. Perfect. For a five. Yikes! Okay. Um, you out. start to kind of slide down. Uh-huh. Have either Violet and Little Buddy or Howl see if they can catch you. Um... I'll have Violet do it and like set little buddy on Hal's back as he okay. stays where he's at and yeah. then she'll help me out. Cool. What's she doing? So it'll be a dexterity save okay. from Violet to see if she can 
catch you in time. 17. Oh yeah. As you're, you're starting to fall, she kind of catches your shirt just enough that you're like sliding down <laughs> instead of falling and then you kind of get your, okay. you get your footing. Cool. But, <laughs> but little buddies out there going, woo! <laughs> woo! And I gotta try to climb again? Yeah. Strength, more strength. More strength. Nine, oh okay. boy. Um, that's enough to make progress. It's not like vertical, so you're not like, ah! Oh, yeah. You're just falling. Um, and I mean, it's designed for like people of all ages to be able to make it up there. So you're, you're able to like make some progress. It's just kind of slow. But after, oh, I have an idea. Yeah, fire away. Uh, can, uh, can I have Violet try to Comet Punch some grips? Yeah, sure. The, yeah, I want to do yeah. that. Yeah, so make your your next check with advantage. Okay. And if you do well enough, you're done. You'll make it there. So punch like this. This is just me plate. again? Yep. Okay. This is just you strengthen your way up. 15. Boom. Yeah, yeah, you're able to, oh. with Violet kind of up ahead going, <laughs> punching holes in it. Cool. Makes it a lot easier for you to climb up. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't think of that <laughs> <laughs> There you go. And then uh, Hal and Little Buddy kind of climb up alongside you, and Little Buddy's like clapping. Yeah, woo! He's like cheering guys. Points. I'm so proud of all of you. Yeah. So you make it to the top, um, and you see uh, the, at the rim of this volcano, it's a, a 10 foot wide, 60 foot diameter circle. Okay. So imagine like a giant, like actual like maw of a volcano. Okay. Um, and you can see down below is like some steam vents kind of huh. and it's like slowly filling up with just molten iron and slag Dang. Um, and on the sides of the volcano are little channels that lead out to the various portions of the the soul forge uh -huh. and that's where the metal goes to get processed wow. so when it fills up all the elements get filtered out and they go down their respective channels that's cool but on the other side of this volcano is this kind of older lady and she's sitting uh, with something that looks like a much bigger um down on all fours, little buddy. Okay. Um, and she's also got this like fiery dog with okay. like a big bushy like flame tail. Okay. Kind of sat there and she just goes, hello. Hi. Hello dear. You've made it. <laughs> I did. I made it. You made it all the way up. I'm so proud. Thank you. Now, um, how, how did you fare against Mackenzie? Uh, by the seat of my pants. Excellent. <laughs> so this challenge should push you further. Um, it is a double battle of sorts. Okay. So pick two of your friends that you think fight well together. Together, I have to pick Howl and Little Buddy. Okay. They had their moment yesterday before we came to yeah. the gym. I got it. Don't forget your charcoal. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm thinking in okay. my head. Yes. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. So she goes, okay, excellent. Um... You will be fighting uh, my, my two partners, okay. Minerva and Jupiter. Okay. Um, cool, cool. If the, if the fates are with you, your team will follow your orders to a T, and you will make it through this unscathed. Oh. Are you ready? <laughs> yes. What was your name? She says, my name is Eleanor. All right. I'm Milo. Nice to meet you. This is a pleasure to meet you. Let's get one initiative roll from you, okay. and add both of their dexterity modifiers to it. I'm gonna. I want to try something here. So I'm gonna yeah. tell little buddy mm -hmm. to just put down a a circle of smoke with yeah. a smoke screen, cool, so that they can't see where I am, and have howl, howl, and then run around to the side. Okay. So you're dropping some smoke. Yeah. And then you run around? Yeah, like, so that, like, they still can't see me, and, like, they heard me here. Yeah. But we're over here. Okay. How far does he run? Not that far. Like, as far around as he can go without being seen. Okay. So it's not, okay, not really that far, yeah. Cool. Okay. Yeah, and you, you can kind of notice, um, as Milo standing off to the side, um, you can see, like, Howl and Little Buddy are breathing, like, in mm -hmm. sync. Okay. Kind of, like... Everything seems to be going well. Like yeah. little buddy's holding onto the charcoal yes. and like buckled in for safety, and away they go. So the two Eleanor just holds up her two hands and says, "Go," and uh, Minerva goes right and Jupiter goes left. Okay. So the Flareon's over here. Okay. The Colaba's over here. Okay. And they just start branching around the sides. Okay. They they move their their speed, and then uh, Minerva just sort of sits, and stares towards the smoke and just launches a spiral of flame. 
a disadvantage because she doesn't know what she's aiming at. Yeah. She's just she's just thrown wide. It's a six and a three. So the you watch as the fire spin just gets closer and closer, and it arcs right under the ground, like probably six or seven feet away from Howl Little Buddy, and it just stays there. And it just spins and spirals. Okay. And it's like right where Howl was when he when he let out his howl. Okay. Um, and then you watch as Jupiter the Quilava just sees where that fire spin is and just launches a gout of flame across the the gap Got of it. the volcano. And it just you you can see as Milo, there's like the fire spin and then just <laughs> just incinerates whatever would have been there. Okay. And then the fire spin <laughs> remains, but the yeah. flamethrower dies out. Okay. Nutty. Woo! And then it's back to Team Milo. Um, they are going to try to do, I'm going to tell them to do the move they practiced yesterday. Just okay. synchronize your fire. Synchronize fire. Okay, cool. So, um, you may have them both, essentially, they're both going to help each other do it. So they both make their attacks with advantage. Okay. Because they're in sync um, things are going well. Do, I'll just roll it and then... Mm-hmm. Wow. Nine and nine. Incredible. Can you do it again? No. No. So that'd be a 16 for Howl and a 12 for Little Buddy. And they're aiming at the Kolava. Kolava. 16 will hit, 12 will miss. Okay. However, um, I will offer you this one chance. Not knowing what the AC is. You can sacrifice any Ooh, number some. of howls to hit and give it to little buddy. The sixteen and twelve. Sixteen and twelve. Let's make it double fourteen. Double fourteen. Even if it misses, just put them together. You going for it? Yeah. Both hit. Yes. <laughs> Boom. Six and seven. Six so and seven. Thirteen. So thirteen. Dang, they're like in perfect sync. Yeah, uh, Jupiter takes a colossal hit from the twin flames that start uh, just surrounding him in fire. Um, however, you watch as the flames on his back with each consecutive hit um, grow exponentially. So okay. he seems incredibly okay. fired up, so, so to speak. Okay. So it might be... It might behoove me to take him out. It might be dangerous to allow him to... To live. To be alive. Die. Um, it is worth noting he does not recover his flamethrower at the start of his turn. Um, well, that's good. Yes! And then, yeah, so it's it's a Team Eleanor's go. Okay. And she's going to shoot... Uh, Minerva's going to shoot a fire spin towards the, towards the team. Okay. Mm. That is a unnatural 20. Uh, okay. And that is an amount of fire damage. Um, Howl takes two. Okay. Little Buddy takes four. Okay. Um, and then, since they are surrounded, um, Jupiter is going to look in their general direction with his incredibly engorged flames and spit an ember of his own. That's a 12 to hit Howl. It misses. So an, an incredibly large ball of fire shoots towards uh, the both of them as Howl just kind of like tuck and rolls on top of Little Buddy and shields him from the flame and then nice. kind of lifts him up by the scruff of the neck and throws him back on his back. Nice. Um, so the two of them are safe, but they are still surrounded by the fire spin. So if they try to leave that circle, mm-hmm. okay. they, would, they would likely take some heat. Okay. But it is Team Milo's turn. I'm gonna yell at him to do it again. I was debating here. No, let's just do it again. Okay. Do it again. So we're, we're doing another yes. double gap of flame. Yes. Okay. So Little Buddy gets to do an extra die damage. Okay. Yes. Okay. And Howl does basically just bites damage from a distance. But well, now he's a d6 because Howl wore off. Yeah. So he'll be his d6 plus, plus d4. 12 and 6. 12 and 6? Because they don't do they, yes. they don't get advantage anymore. Um, they're still in sync, technically, so they would both be helping each other. So, yeah? Mm-hmm. Because you're thinking with portals. 
No. So 12 and a 21. 12 and a 21. I will offer you the same deal. So yeah, he should be able to get him if he gives him two and it's 16 and 14. Mm-hmm. But he's going to give him three, so it's 15 and 15. Perfect. Because I want Keep them to them be in sync. Insane. Yeah, even better. Very smart. Okay. Yeah, so both hit. So go ahead and roll an incredible amount of fire damage. And hopefully kill this So one. that is a, oh boy, a four from Howl. Oh, yikes. And that's seven from Little Buddy. So, so 11, 11 total. Okay. Um, yeah, as you watch as, uh, from the inside of this fire spin, um, as Minerva's kind of just ticking her head back and forth, almost like a metronome, mm-hmm. and just keeping the fire spinning. Um, as Jupiter kind of leans back for another gout of flame, two, two of your own come towards him, and he just goes, and just turns around and takes it on the back as the, the rest of his uh, fire begins to like, expand once more. <laughs> He's getting big! However, you're fighting in sync. Yes. One of your teammates can make another attack. What? Okay. Little buddy is going to let out a smoke screen towards okay. Minerva. Perfect. Uh, the fire spin around you. Uh, Perfect. It's fixed. Perfect. As you gather, he Perfect. has broken her concentration. Um, it is now their turn. Team Eleanor's turn. Um, oh, dear God. So Jupiter gets Flamethrower back. Okay. Um, <laughs> so Howl with advantage. Okay. Um, little Buddy with advantage because he's being carried by Howl. Um, two different dexterity saves. Advantage, he said? <laughs> Uh, 13 for Howl, okay. and uh, an 11 for Little Buddy. Okay. How, so Howl succeeds. Okay. I will offer you... So mm. I will offer you for Howl to take instead full damage and shield Little Buddy. Not knowing how much damage is incoming, bearing in mind that he's got two... Additional like, charges of not flash even, fire. Not even. Like as if he hadn't made the save. So still have for so resistance. Still take half damage. Yeah. But as though he hadn't made the save. Yeah, that's fine. You do it. Yeah, okay. I'll do it. So here comes a lot of damage, little buddy. Because I would take none. That's his ability. Mm-hmm. I know. That's why I'm offering it to you. A little buddy would get roasted. He'd be dead for sure. Uh, Howl takes 13 points of damage after it's halved. God. Okay. But Howl kind of like rolls over once more and like shields little buddy. Okay. As just an incredible amount of fight as he roasts his back. <laughs> Regurts. Okay. Little buddy would be toast though. Okay. And I want them together. Yeah, little little buddy. I don't think <laughs> like I think that was twice his hit points. <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, so uh, yeah. it's, it's their turn now. It is. It is back to Team Milo okay. as Minerva kind of just makes her way out of the smoke screen. Okay, kind of sits down. Um, and this is gonna be. We are gonna charge. Uh, Minerva the Quilava, right? Did I get the names right. Opposite Love Jupiter it. the Quilava. Yeah. And Hal's just gonna run and bite and like go down for the bite and little buddy's just gonna launch off his back and tack from deck his head. Cool. Um, let's get two attack rolls each at advantage because they will technically be flanking by the time they get there. Make it happen. 15 and 14. Okay. Or natural 20 and 15 for Hal. Okay, so do Howl's damage first, because then he's going to launch Little Buddy for the crit. Okay. God, come on! Three damage. Three. God, um, that D8 is (laughs) cursed. (laughs) Might as well just roll a D6, man. All right. Yeah, okay. And then Little Buddy. six plus this. Six plus this plus one. Eleven. Twelve damage. Twelve damage. Little Buddy. Yeah! Little Buddy. Yeah! Little Buddy. You see a much bigger version of yourself yes. in front of you. How do you want to do that? Yes. Uh, little buddy, honestly, knowing him, he's not even like 
trying for flair. He just is like grasping the charcoal and like launching his body like head down, like please work, please work. Yeah. And, and he just, just goes, <laughs> just knocks him over. Oh, beautiful, um, beautiful. As Jupiter falls, Eleanor just goes, "That's quite enough. Congratulations." Oh. Thank you. You did well. <laughs> Thank you. Your team clearly fights in sync. That's uh, something we've we've been working on really hard. It just worked <laughs> out. <laughs> <It was here. laughs> she goes, it, you would do well to remember your your strategy for this fight. For sure. Okay. In the coming battles. Okay. Okay. Nutty. As you uh, defeat Eleanor and make your way around the volcano. Does Eleanor pay me any money? Eleanor pays you eleven dollars. Nice. She says, "Congratulations." Thank you. And good luck. Thank you. I fear you'll need it. I'm. I think so too. <laughs> okay. So as you um, reach the other end of the uh, volcano with your little team, mm-hmm. um, and you sort of heal up, recuperate, take mm-hmm. a moment. Good job, everybody. High fives all around. I'm just like mentally. I'm thinking like I was so stressed bringing little buddy into this <laughs> gym yeah. battle, but I'm like so thankful that I did. And like, and Howl is crushing it. Oh yeah. And, uh, for sure. He, like he is fast becoming a Pokemon that like, if I'm going to pursue this male business that he can either be my partner Pokemon with me and not deliver mail or alternatively, protect the newbies on their first couple routes oh, because yeah. I know he can handle it. For sure. So... That start, that um, is coming to my mind. Yeah. Um, but as you um, reach the other side of the uh-huh. volcano, um, you feel a little stronger, a little wiser. Um, and you see a river of lava. Oh, boy. Oh, and boy. a very narrow stone bridge all the way across. <laughs> it is... Wide enough that you don't have to make any kind of check to get across. It's just very <laughs> uncomfortable. Okay. Yeah, I'm just I'm thinking of poor Bentley. Yeah. He gets to this point. I feel like there's going to be some PTSD there. <laughs> <laughs> He'll be crawling all the floors. Yeah. That makes it so much worse. He'll be closer to the lava. Um, but yeah, as you as you approach this massive chamber with the river of lava, mm-hmm. with a narrow pathway across, there's a very tall, kind of lanky dude. He's got his arms crossed. Looks pretty eager to fight you. Oh, man. He just goes, what's up, bro? Hey. You made it pretty far. Uh, so far, so good. Yeah, you're not going any farther than me, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, Jax doesn't have to waste his time with you. Oh. I'm going to take you down. Well, I'm going to do my best to not let that happen. He goes, that's the spirit. <laughs> he goes, my name's Lewis, by the way. Hey, Lewis, I'm Milo. Cool. Thank you. You ready? I think so. Okay. Do I have to cross this bridge to get to you? I mean, yeah. Okay. <laughs> We're going to fight in the next room, but okay. they, they like to set scenes here. How far long is this bridge? It's like 20 feet. Um, you can cross it. Are, is my, uh, are my Pokemon still restricted from being inside their Pokeballs? Okay. That was just for the climb. Okay, I'm going to call them back, but send out Violet and, okay. and just say, hey, just let me hold on to your bottom two legs. <laughs> I'm going to just run with my eyes closed. Ah! Across the <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, this is like, that was weird. Yeah. But, it's, okay. It's, bridges are, uh, yeah, a little scary. Yeah. So you enter into a more like standard, like gym room that you would expect. Okay. It's like a big rectangular room, um, but with two big dividers that come down the middle, dividing it into three chambers. Okay. Like so. Oh boy. Um, and he says. My challenge is easily the most difficult of the whole gym. Uh-huh. And someday, Jax will recognize that and let me take over. <laughs> uh, Are we going to do three separate single battles? You're like, going to do three separate like single a, battles. Like a man playing chess with three yes, people. Yes, exactly. <laughs> um, so, you're going to roll. <laughs> Basically, he throws out his team. And he will, he will do a Magmar. What? A Charmeleon and a Rapidash. And I'll put these away. <laughs> um, and he says, yeah, you can pretty much pick wherever you want to put your guys. I don't really care. I'm not going to adjust my strategy or anything. So who's fighting who? 
Ladybug, Violet, is matching Rapidash. Okay. Little Buddy is fighting Magmar. Howl is fighting Charmeleon. Sick. All right. It's an uh, initiative time. Howl, howl is going to let out a howl. Okay. He does so. He goes, oh. And he feels, he feels fired up and inspired. Yes. Fired up and inspired up. Yes. Um, Charmeleon is in the ring with Howl. Uh-huh. He just walks up and goes, whoosh, whips out those purple claws. Closes the gap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. And misses. Yeah, love it. An eight. It's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> exactly how I wanted that to go. <laughs> He's seen the Matrix. Uh, Rapidash closes the gap on Violet. Okay. Attempts to hoof her in the face for a 13. Hoof hoofs her in the face for nine damage. Oh, oh my god! What a hit for the first one. <laughs> I think what? it did. I think it did. Uh, oh. Megmar. Okay. Attempts to throw some fire. Okay. Little buddy. Sure. Boop. Twelve. That exactly hits. Oh boy. Uh, eight. Oh my god. Eight fire. And then it's violent. Violet. Violet up against Rapid Edge. Perfect. Focus energy combo punch. Let's Get do him. this. Yikes. Two punches. 13 and a 21. Oh, crit. Crit hits. Just the crit. Just the crit. Four. Plus four is eight. Eight. Eight is damage, so I'm okay with it. Goes to that amount of HP. Yeah, Violet just goes whack, just right under the chin. Yes. And the rabbit edge is like still sore from the last, like ten minutes ago. He's <laughs> like, oh, oh, oh. Little buddy is gonna fire back. Mm-hmm. Some fire of his own. Yeah. Please, little buddy. 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 Fifteen. No. Misses. Strong out of flame. Just bounces off the of Magmar's belly. Darn it. How? Um, how? Freaking bite him. Uh, 11. No, 12. Ah, you're so close. Missed by one. So very, very close. Charmeleon attempts to claw you in the face. Wow, set up for nothing. Attempts to cut you in the eyes. And misses again. Okay. Another eight. Okay, okay, okay. He cannot hit you. Rapidash. Hoofs Violet. Misses. That's Thank a nine. Thank God. Um, and then Magmar spits fire at little buddy. Misses. Okay. Eight. All right. All right, squad. Power up. Mm-hmm. Comet punch for three punches. Nine. Fourteen. Twelve. One hits. Oh. Three damage. Three damage. Cool. Little buddy. Shoot the fire back. Close the gap like three feet. Just like get a little bit closer. Make it a little easier for you. There it is. 22. 22 hits. Four damage. <laughs> Four damage. Howl. Bite this fool. Howl goes to bite Charmeleon on the head. Great. That's beautiful. So eight plus. 16, 17 damage. Freaking love you. Uh, Freaking love you. So much. That's a very good hit right That's there. That's Talador. As, <laughs> this Hal just runs up and bites Charmeleon right on the snout. Just like, <laughs> just sinks in. Chop, chop. Um, Charmeleon attempts to claw him off his face. Good luck with that. 19. Aww, uh, shouldn't have taunted you. Probably not. Five points of force damage. Okay. Claws right up uh, Howl's belly. And then Rapidash attempts to hoof Violet in the face. Okay. Insufficient. Yes! Goes wide. That's um, the best. Magmar tries to spit more fire more than buddy. anyone I want Rapidash to miss. That hits. Okay, that's fine. That very hits. Just do less than... Two. Yes. Two fire. Beautiful. That's Two. ideal. I want Two Magmar fire. to hit, I want Rapidash to miss. Uh, Beautiful. Violet. Violet. Fire away. Do it again. Boom. Consecutive Three punches. punches. Two hits. Seven damage. Yikes! Rapidash already looking okay, looking low. Okay. And so yeah, I'm running there. Now I'm running all the way to the to the back to the middle. Mm-hmm. Little buddy, fire off another ember. Okay. Come on, hit this time, please. So is, oh! is Milo just running to each chamber, yes. shouting orders? Yeah, okay. seven. So misses. LB misses. All right, but he's like, do an ember, and he runs away, and he like hears nothing hits. Frick! How? How? Bite him. For a 15. 15 hits? Yes. 
for yeah, five it's damage. <laughs> yeah, it's... God. That okay. Was... Yeah. Uh, Charmeleon takes a big hit and tries to dish one right back to you. Insufficient. That will not do. Rabidash attempts to hoof Violet in the face. This is the one that matters. Natural one. Oh, yeah! As uh, Rapidash brings down the hoof, it... Oh. You can see, like, a prior injury seems to be spiking back up, and it just rolls a hoof. Oh, And ow. it now is just favoring the leg and kind of, like, teetering. Ah, man, now I have a target. And Lewis is like, not again, dude! Gotta be careful of the leg! And then, uh, Magmar hits, hits little buddy. Five. Okay, that's fine. Five we, can order that. we can order that, because he gets to roll extra damage. If he hits... Violet, focus up, mm -hmm. punch that Rapidash for three hits. Three hits in the face. In three one in the face. leg. Nope. Mm -hmm. Nine. Natural 20 in the leg. And an unnatural 20. Two hits. Okay, this is the crit in the leg. Four plus four is eight damage. Jesus. Plus another one, so nine total damage. Rapidash is barely holding on to double digits. <laughs> Um, so yeah, that's Violet. Violet just runs up, clocks this Rapidash, tries to hit it right in the hoof. Don't remember. LB. Come on, I believe in you tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I believe in you tomorrow. Keep running, how? Uh, amazing. Bite him. How? Uh, 14. 14 hits? Yes. For 8 damage. 8. Working up sweat. Working up sweat. <laughs> Me too. Working up sweat. It's very sweaty in here. Um, Charmeleon, having get get bit on the face again. Very hits. Uh, six. Okay. Six force damage. All right. That's not and we increment the die. Uh, Rapidash mm -hmm. at disadvantage. Mm -hmm. He's got a broken foot. Mm -hmm. Two, one. Once again, breaks down that sprained ankle. And you hear an actual like crack. Ouch. Um, and Lewis is like, no, oh, dude, stop. And this is just like, and it's just super favoring that hoof. So, Magmar. Misses. Run rapid fire. I rapid. feel bad, Lewis, for your rapid dash. Do you want to like call that side a draw? He goes, no. No, that's not what a future gym leader would do. Okay, I just feel bad for your Pokemon. I feel like it's really hurt. But no. Okay. It's fine. All right. Rapidash is fine. All right. He's gonna be fine. Okay. The battle continues. <laughs> okay. So Violet's up, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Violet's gonna comet punch again yeah. for four more punches. I'll just break all his legs. I feel so bad. They all hit. Oh my god. There's not gonna be a Rapidash right now. One. Two, and there might be three. Yeah. Six. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah. <laughs> that really sucks. He's not a big game, but that he's sucks. still standing. I still went, I went a little easy. You just on. needed to average two damage on yeah. each one. And he's yeah. not quite there. Um, boop. Little so buddy. by this time, little buddy. All right, little buddy. Um, Get him. I'm just going to yell, howl, bite him again, and just like focus on little buddy, little buddy. Um, Get a little bit closer. Just a little bit though, like two or three more. Come a little bit closer, my And yeah. focus, like aim your snout a little bit higher than where Magmar is, because gravity's gonna hit, right? And shoot your little ember, I believe in you, you're the best. Bloop. For a 15 to hit. 15. Not enough. Howl. Howl's gonna bite him on his own, because he knows what he's doing. He's yeah. a beast. And he's gonna get Jesus. So eight, eight plus plus five plus four, so seventeen. How does Howl yes. want to take out Tremulin? Um Howl isn't even gonna bite him. He just knows from what I just did by saying like, hey bite him, I need I go back to focus on little buddy. Little buddy's not doing so hot. He knows that taking out this Charmeleon will open the gate so he can help. So he kind of like jumps to the side, back kicks him with his legs like into the wall and just like as it's coming down, like jumping over it to cool. come help. Cool. Take those. Boom. Yeah, the wall comes down and you can see Lewis is like, what? <laughs> what? Uh, Rapidash has like all, all kinds of problems going on. Mm -hmm. um, attempts to hoof Violet in the face for a 13. A little bit. I don't like that. 
eight points of damage. Oh, about. she's gone. She's gone. No. no. Which which chamber is she in? This one. That one. The other wall comes down, and rapid just goes as much as it can with. Yeah, up, it up, hobbles up. over to Magmar and is like, "Bro, help! My legs, my legs, they are so broken." Um, Magmar attempts to throw a gout of flame towards this new threat of hell. Okay, I kind of positioned him in between to protect his. That is a seventeen to hit teammate, buddy. That'll hit. You take half of eleven, which is five. Thank God. Okay. And then little it is buddy. little buddy. Little buddy would have been aced. Little buddy. Little buddy. It's gonna come around a little bit. Mm-hmm. Confident in his own. Yeah. And try to f- ember the rapid ash. Okay. Make it happen. Make it so. Fourteen. Exactly. Thank God. For <laughs> four damn. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Why did I roll six? I don't know. It's D eight. Six damage. Dang. Isn't that so much better when you actually kill something? With it. Well, I mean, the, my D8's a bit sharp. How does Little yes. Buddy take out this incredibly wounded horse? <laughs> uh, little Buddy, uh, not having been producing the best results, still doesn't really like let out a huge fire, but it's like enough to knock it over, and he's just yeah. like, yeah! <laughs> Sometimes you get a snipe. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Um, oh, boy. Hell's... Is after the little buddy? Nuts. There's very little left on the field, right? I want to scoop him up again, like Minerva Jupiter. Oh, yeah, like flip him under your back. Yeah. Yeah. And then, uh. She, she literally, like, told you to do it. Yeah, I know. So you're good. It's okay. <laughs> can, can they run up together? And I want. Howl's gonna howl. Okay. But can Little Buddy try to howl too, just for fun? Sure. Okay. Let's get a charisma check from Little Buddy. Okay. A six. It's adorable, <laughs> but it doesn't really do much okay. for you. It's all right. That's what friends are for. <laughs> yeah. So they they close the gap. Yeah. Okay. Magmar. Yeah. Coughs up a lemon. Quite literally, it's a seven to hit you. Yes. <laughs> yeah, big miss. Big, big miss. Okay. And it's back to little buddy. All right, you guys, well, since they're together, mm-hmm. technically an initiative, they're going to try to do their, their fire move together. Yeah. Make it happen. Make it be so. Right now it's a 17 for Howl. Okay. And a miss from little buddy. Okay. Howl will hit. Okay. Are they going for the Milo special? No, they were doing their fire move. Okay. Get yes. start. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. So, go ahead and roll your damage for Howl, but okay. little buddy misses. So, I'm doing just an ember hit, right? Mm-hmm. Four damage. I mean, it's a hit. Yeah, it's a hit. A hit is a hit. No matter how pitiful. Um, yeah, so one one good gout of flame from Howl, little buddy, you know, is still trying to match Howl's actual Howl. I was like, what? <laughs> Um, and then it's it's Magmar. Magmar throws fire. Um, does a 13 hit how? Mm-hmm. Half of nine is four. Oh. Okay. Um, Still going. It's back to the squad. The dream team. The Duke of Spook. Let's Sorry, try it one more time. One more time. Fire combo. Okay. Fire combo together. Get it. Get it 21 and a 16. Or... A 22 and a 21. Both hit. All right, squad fam. We're going to do the D6s together and add four for 13 damage. I like it. I like it. That is a lot like of it. Magmar's total like hit points. Like it. Still standing, but not by much. He could not take another of those. Incoming fire spit. Blah. Ten. Yes. Misses. Yes. All right. That guys. guy sucks right now. <laughs> um, it's bad. He's doing poorly. We're gonna, it's okay. We're going to do the biting tackle. Okay. The it's biting your tackle. Finishing move. You got it. So it's a t- unnatural 20 from little buddy. And or a twenty-two from Little Buddy and a thirteen from Hal. 
Little buddy hits. For four damage. <laughs> oh, oh boy. boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. He goes to that. <laughs> oh boy. Poor little buddy. Oh boy. You take five points of fire damage oh, on contact. Oh no. Magmar. Oh, little buddy's out. Little buddy's out. Little buddy's out. Alright, it's Hal v. Magmar. Oh no. Magmar. Spits flame in hell. For a nine. Misses. Hell's turn. He's got a bite. Fourteen. Fourteen misses. Or Thirteen even. <laughs> oh god! Um, how does a sixteen look? That hits for sure. Two. Has one damage sound. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds great. Even though it's two. Two ones on D6s. I threw the first one was like a one. Like, Bite him out! Finish it! Another bite misses. Get just a goopy flesh. Has a 12 sound. Misses. Oh god. No! Did you miss again? Yes, it was oh, a 17 no. and a flop. What is potentially the final gout of flame? Carry on now. It's a 10. It's a stalemate. It's wide. Yeah, nobody can hit anybody. 17. That exactly hits. I know. Hell's Jesus. just bitterly staying alive in Magmar. Please. Can't hit. Just get him. Just get him. Five. Five? He's got one left. How many hit points do you have left? Three. So you take five points of fire damage when you bite, but Magmar also goes down. So I live with one? Because he rounded down? Yeah. Or you already did? No, you would take two. So I have one HP. You have one HP and Magmar goes down. <laughs> oh, yeah. The stalemate is over. You finally killed him. Lewis just goes, You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Can I just shake your hand on one of the most intense battles I've ever had in my life? He goes, Yeah. Put it there, kid. Thank you. He goes, I believe I owe you some money. That is a 12, and that is 15. He pays you $15. I don't think I can get anything harder And than Lewis just goes, um, Jax is up, up there. Yeah, you know, dude, you got it. I'm so mad. Sorry, dude. Your setup is awesome, though. I like that. The yeah. idea of that. Yeah, thanks. Jax doesn't give me enough appreciation for it. Um, but I'll show him when you beat him, and then I beat him. So... Okay. I'll be the gym leader. So. <laughs> Good luck to you, Lewis. Sick. Thanks, man. Good luck to you as well. As the ground beneath you uh -huh. begins to shake uh -huh. and rise, yep. and a stadium ceiling opens up, revealing the hot xanthan sun. Oh, boy. As you rise all the way to the roof of the Soul Forge, and you see uh, Jax leaning back in a chair. Just goes, well, hot dog! Hey, man! Hey! How you been? Uh, it's been a climb, pun intended. Yeah! <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like it, I appreciate it. Uh, you have an amazing gym, and the trainers here are awesome, and their challenges are really cool as well. Yes. Yeah, they're, 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 they're hot. Um, yeah, I like it. And uh, I am gonna be honest with you, I'm shaking on the inside, but I <laughs> am excited to see what challenge awaits me. He says, well, it's a stupid man that fights without fear, so welcome to the roof of the Xanthan gym. Oh, my Milo. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Now, won't be needing those. Um, I should warn you, this challenge will likely be the toughest of them all. Okay. Um, despite what I'm about to tell you. You can use your whole team. Okay. I will use one of mine at a time. Oh, okay. Are you ready? Does, do I see Monty flying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do not see Monty. Okay. Um, there he goes. This will be this will be good. This will be good. Yeah. A nice healthy battle. Nothing to the death. No. No spooky cadavers or ghosts up here. That's just true. 
Just sure. two individuals yes. battling it out with their best friends. For sure. Right? Respect. All right. Uh, your first, first challenge from me It's my good old pal Hades. You All ready? Right. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, so you may throw your team out wherever you'd like. Okay. As a Houndoom hits the field. Oh! Right Sweet! Here. Initiative? Initiative. Top of the round. Little buddy. Little buddy. Start us off strong, bud. He's gonna shoot right here. Uh, a smoke screen. Beautiful. A smoke screen goes up. Hades at this point is like, dang it, I can't see him now. Um, and he just... He takes a couple steps forward, how far you're not really sure, and just lets out a roar. Um, I need your whole squad to make wisdom saving throws. Oh my god. Uh, Anybody lower than a three? Nope. No need to do any more math. Okay. The lowest Every, is a 13. Um, your whole squad is immune to being afraid of Houndoom for the next day. Sweet. So that is that is Hades' first turn. So now it's my over two's turn. It is now the rest of the squad. So Howl's gonna run behind this boulder mm -hmm. and Howl himself. Yeah. And Tell suck himself up. Violet's gonna follow with them. Okay. Excellent. Top of the round is Little Buddy. Little Buddy's gonna hold his action. Okay. For anything in particular? Um and what is he waiting for? Like, what's he waiting for? What's he going to do when it happens? He's waiting for Howl to get closer because he's on his back. Okay. So when Howl gets closer, he's going to do a thing. Okay. Is he going to attack? Um, probably. Okay. So he's holding his attack for when Howl gets closer. Hey, it's his turn. He's going to attempt to perceive you. Go ahead and have Howl make a stealth check. Five. Yeah, he hears you. Yeah. And he goes. Oh, hello. And he closes the gap and he attempts to bite Howl in the face. Okay. For a thirteen. That's exactly enough. That's exactly enough. Eleven. That's after being out. Yeah. It's a big. Yeah. No kidding. hit. Jesus. Big hit. Okay. Big hit. As, yeah, Houndoom just... <laughs> fiery fangs all the way on Growl's face. Howl's okay. face. Not Growl. Howl. Yeah. Howl's face. They're going to open it up with the the bite tackle. The old one, too. Yeah. Get him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get it. Oh! <laughs> Roll on this side of the table. Not any better. For worse. Not worse. What is your highest to hit? Ten. Ten is not a safely assumed. Uh, all of the and all while, of the just go while they're distracting them, which of course was my plan for them to miss, Violet will swing around this side okay. and try to um Yeah, so he's flanked punch advantage for two whole punches. We will have advantage. It's a twenty-two for that one, and the second one is a crit. twenty crit. 20 crit. 20 crit. <laughs> okay. So two First one, second one's a crit. Is two damage. Two. Plus four is six. Plus three is nine damage. Nine damage. No, I will not. Okay. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he gets punched in the face twice, and he's not happy about it. Um, it's a little buddy. Well, no, I held his action. Oh, but this is his new it's one, then. Well, Yum. you know what? <laughs> Ember, because it's my only move, technically. Hit him in the face. Thank God for flanks. 17. Hits. For three damage. Three! <laughs> Little buddy goes, <laughs> and just shoots out a little fire and goes, does it? Shoot. It does. And he kind of cocks afterwards. Okay. As uh, Houndoom just absorbs the fire into its skin. It's uh, just like, oh. Man, okay. <sighs> No, and no. then he opens his incredible jaws um, and just attempts to bite Howl once more. Where are all the dice? There they are. It's a 19 to hit. Mm. 18 to hit, sorry. Mm. It's a lot, huh? Mm. Well, on the bright side, you're taking half. Nine. 
Already halved? Yeah. Oh god, this is not gonna end well. This is no chance. After Hades is howl. Howl, bite him. Bite him. Bite him in the face. He's flunking. 14. Misses. Violet, focus energy, common punch for two punches. <laughs> For a 17 Hits. and a uh, unnatural 20. It's one day. Oh. oh! Oh! Five damage. Five damage. Okay, things are not looking good in Camp Milo, but Violet's like. <laughs> two good punches as Hades just like turns its head to look towards Violet. It's little buddy's turn. Um, go little buddy. Um, little buddy is just gonna not attack and okay. use all of his movement of 60 feet or whatever he has and just run loops around his legs to try to distract him. So never leaving his sphere yeah. of attack but just try to confuse him? Yeah. Okay. Cool. I will say out of sheer like enjoyment, Hades gets a little distracted and it's just like... <laughs> tries to hop on little buddy, but if he can get him, it's an eleven. No, he misses. He does try to like chomp down on little buddy, but little buddy's like, <laughs> as he just runs, he dodges. Um, so that bought you a turn, uh, and then uh, Hades just goes, and kind of shakes it off. It's hell. Okay, hell, bite him, please. Please, please bite him, yeah. Please bite him, yeah. 17 to hit. Mm -hmm. You have advantage. Oh, yeah. You could maybe crit. You sort of need the Super extra dope. damage. Super didn't crit. Oh, uh, no. Five damage. This is going to take a really long time. <laughs> yes, it is. No, no. Uh, Hell bites down on Hades. And Hades is just like, bro, you're so small. I know. Don't bite me. Violet, punch him. Punch. Five attacks incoming. All at advantage. So one hit. One, one damage. damage. I'm gonna be here all day. Just give me, give me one damage. One punch. One hit. Oh god. Yeah, Violet does one damage to Hades. Punch him in the buns. Oh, and it's the little buddy's turn, right? Ember, little buddy, please! Come on! Advantage, please. Work in my favor. 16. 16 hits. For 7 damage, little buddy. D8. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is just there. Can't help it. For, there we go, 10 damage. About time you did. Hey, we've done a, a quarter of his HP. He's done half of mine. <laughs> After little buddy is Hades, yep. who tries to bite Violet. For 23. Oh, that's not enough. Wow, that's super fast. <laughs> Incoming. She might live. It's only 13. Oh! Hell's turn. Freaking bite him. Bite that's him all face. we can do. That's all bite we him. can do. Bite him. That's all we can Kill do. Him. Come on. 13. 13 misses. Violet, comma punch, please. For four punches. Two hits. For one damage and two damage, so three damage. There's no chance. Little buddy, ember him, please. Advantage means not 17. <laughs> Hits. D8. <Oops. laughs> I'll never learn. Eight damage. Little buddy. Little buddy. He is. Me, little buddy, become medium buddy. <laughs> That's the only way I see a chance right now. Little buddy to become medium buddy. Um, yeah, that's a, that's a good hit. It's a strong hit. It's a very strong hit. Um, as Hades opens the jaws of death towards Violet. It's an unnatural 20. Rip. He is going for. Are you rolling crunch. more than one die? Did you do one hit point? I have two. You have two? No. Yeah, so she did. She goes down. That's a total of seven damage. Rip. And Violet would have had to make a strength save or have its AC reduced, but Violet was down. Uh, she doesn't. Yeah, she's Violet has a four. She's a death. 10 AC is unconscious yeah. as you 
pulling her back. Oh god, I'm feeling so overwhelmed right now, but I know that but Owl can at least land an attack. If we can get rid of Hades, I know there's no chance we win this, but if we can just get rid of Hades, I'm right, happy. Alright, Hal. Just about it. For, that's a 18. Can you crit? 21. Can, can you crit? <laughs> nope. Yeah. Get him. Boom. Five damage. Five. Boom. Oh. That's, a, that's a big five. Alright, Ember. Twenty-three. Twenty-three hits. You remember? Six damage. You remember. You're believing. <laughs> Woo! He's getting low. He's getting <laughs> real low. <laughs> but you gotta do a little better and not die. Yeah. Right now. You ready? A little buddy. Incoming. A bite. Oh my god. How please. How please. <laughs> 15. 15 exactly. Oh my god. Good. For 6 damage. Do nothing if not consistent. Little buddy, Amber. Uh oh. Oh, thank god. Ooh. 21 to hit. 21 hits. Little buddy, one. please. 7 damage. 7 damage. My son, you're so close. You're so close. Hades comes in for a bite. He's gonna go for hell. Snap, son. I think you're okay. How much up to you? How much damage did you do? <laughs> I have four HP. You have four? Yeah. You're not okay. okay? Yeah. It's a low roll, but it's, yeah, it's not, not that low. How it goes down. Little buddy. Little, Little buddy. buddy. In the death throes of Howl. Little buddy. Take us home. Little buddy. Deliver please. us from this madness. Not enough. The ember just kind of scatters across the floor. Fifteen. Tight. Oh God. He's trying to crunch it. I think that's little buddy's max hit points plus like six. One of those is not a D10. Roll the same thing. Not a changes. Twenty. He's got 20 damage. He goes down. He's down. Jax just goes, Kiddo, you put up a heck of a fight. You, uh, you had Hades on the ropes there. I don't know if you noticed that. But there were more after Hades, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah. No. Yeah, I'm not ready for this. <laughs> He's like, listen, you train up, you come back. You find me again anytime, okay? Okay. Deal. Here's a little tidbit. Next time you want to fight, there's a ladder around the back of the gym. Just, okay. <laughs> All right. just coming up. Tell your friends, you. just in case. Thank you. Okay. Uh, yeah, concerned about my my friend's health. I'm gonna I'm gonna call it for now. Okay. And As you just kind of dejectedly you make your way back down. Yeah. Through the gym. Do you take the ladder down? No. No. You go all the way back down. Yep. Okay. You just dejectedly climb down the volcano. You ride the, the elevator. Yep. And you open the door and you see all your friends. You just go. Hey. 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 Uh, and that's where this one will end for now. It seems Milo and his team were not able to last in the heat of battle. But perhaps they can rekindle the fires of war.